Huh. Really wasn't expected to make, make this so soon. Honestly, yeah, I thought I would have to wait at least two months. At max, probably a year. But I really wasn't expecting this. I expected for this fight to kind of fix himself or, you know, not be a complete asshole in a different way or be transphobic. But here we are talking about Varlicify once again. <laughs> My life is a fucking mess. But anyways, other than my life being a mess, yes, Varlicify is transphobic. We will talk about that later in the video. Probably going to be the last thing I talk about unless he does something stupid while I edit this. But yeah, <laughs> there, there's there been a lot. Varlicify is actually back on Twitter. I checked and also I know his other account. <laughs> I know all three of Varlicify's real accounts. That's right, baby. <laughs> That's right. We we found the real Varlicify on Twitter, baby. I also know it's all because, you know, same profile picture. Uh, I won't show it, but, you know. I know it. I know it off by heart, so. Yeah, <laughs> Varlicify. Back at it again with the two accounts. So anyways, let's get started with some smaller stuff before we hit the big transphobia part. Okay, it sounds good to me. I assume it sounds good to you. So yeah, let's go from littlest problem to what the fuck problem. Let's go. Here's, let's start with the smallest, uh, thing he has done in recent times, you know, since the last video. He deleted his EV video because it wasn't the next trailer, like he said. He said it would be the next trailer, um, Varlicify. Where is it? Where's the new evolution, Varlicify? You promised it would be in the next trailer. What the fuck? <laughs> I know, I'm just... Go and play this off as comedic, but Varless Five was wrong about the EV, and he deleted his video. Even though he could have just kept it up and said, "Looks like I was actually wrong," but instead his ego is too fragile. Yeah, nothing more to say here. He called this person unattractive. I'll censor the face and whatever. So yeah, he called this person unattractive. Why is this big? It is really big. It just shows Varlicify thinks he can get a hot girl when he actually can't because he's too narcissistic, too into himself. Which is explained in my previous Varlicify video. If you want to go check out that, go check out. I don't know, leave a like. <laughs> well, but anyways. Yeah, his ass got a ratio to hell with this one, boys. I, I don't know, I, I like how he got ratioed here. I like this. This proves that humanity still has a chance of being alive. I say a chance because there's other problems that isn't of our list why that needs to be fixed. But you know what? I love democracy, boy. I love freedom of speech because we get shit like this. We get this... Boy, a ratioed. Fucking get ratioed, you narcissistic prick. And here comes the big finish. The, the big blam of this video. The huge explosion of this video. Farlicify being transphobic. I mean, I would say it's a surprise, but he's been, like, super right-wing all the time in, on his hot takes video, so... This really isn't a surprise. To me, at least. I mean, come on. The, the things were right there. The info was in your face all along. We all know Verlicify is right-wing. How right-wing? I guess this 
transphobic stuff kind of explains how right wing. Yeah, um, Verlissify. I thought, you know, people could have their own opinions, their own, you know, self of worth, or something that isn't you shoving shit into your fan's mouth, but here we are with these tweets. Nine minutes about. <laughs> Nine minutes of facts about attention seekers. Even though it was just somebody talking about. Rad's rights for children and blah blah blah. You know, usual fucking transphobic right wing shell stuff. But yeah, this proves Varlicify is transphobic. That's right. Yeah, not looking good there, buddy. Not looking good on that transphobia, boy. I mean, my god. Seriously, you're retweeting this shit and complaining why nobody wants to subscribe to your ideals. And you put this shit up. Yeah, you're right wing, I get that, but trans people can also be right wing, so... There's that. <laughs> uh, we all know Verlicify. Oh my god, I didn't do the research. Now my kid is trans. I'm gonna read about it on the internet. <laughs> we all know he's gonna do that when he becomes a parent and his kid turns out trans. We all know this shit. We all know it's gonna happen. Because my god, saying this transphobic shit is the stuff you said in the past, yeah, not looking good for you, buddy. <laughs> Not too much, and let's go to the next step. I was keeping it hidden during the entire video, but let me pull out the the trap card. He called somebody a rage goddess. We all know he calls people mentally ill, but, you know. Here you go, here's proof. Here's your proof. Varlicify is ableist. So, yeah. And Varlicify's mind. <laughs> kind of messed up that lol. <laughs> but yeah, Varlicify's mind. If you're trans, if you're disabled, you don't deserve rights. You deserve to be belittled because I am Varlicify and everything I say is true. Autistic people should not be on this earth. We, we all know he's thinking that. We all know. We all got the catch for Lucify. Thank you for being a piece of shit. You know, for me to make a second video. Thank you for Lucify for giving me more content to talk about. Thank you. Ooh, ooh. Can, can you be more discriminatory so I can do more videos about you? Ooh, ooh. What's this? But yeah. What have we learned about... Varlicify, he hates fat people. He doesn't find them attractive. I wouldn't say hate, he just doesn't find them attractive. But he really posted it on a public Twitter, so... Yeah, not looking good there, buddy. He is transphobic. He is racist. He is ableist. So, yeah. How do people keep subscribing to him, or... You know, liking his videos instead of downvoting it to shit? I don't know. I don't know. We we need to get into the mind of a Varlisfy fan. But since none of them watch my videos, I doubt we will ever get that opportunity. So yeah, bye. I almost forgot to add this in. <laughs> I actually almost forgot. So yeah, you you know how he was banned from the Pokemon Unite Discord server? <laughs> well, uh, yeah, read this. He compared them to pedophiles. That's an implication he's trying to get, of course, because it's Verlo's fight. He's an idiot. So he will try to claim someone's a pedophile when they're not, as a last resort. So, uh, yeah. Hey, Verlicify, how's that pot and kettle thing going? Ha have you checked the mirrors recently? Who am I kidding? You don't check mirrors. Because, obviously, you would see how hypocritical this shit is. But, hey.
Talk about no slandering me. Right? The the guy that totally did slander multiple Poketubers and is slandering a Discord server over because uh, he got banned? Really? Are you that petty of a little bitch? I mean, shit, I knew your dick was small. I didn't think it was this small. Damn. Legit, comparing an entire Discord server to a pedophile type thing. Damn, Verlicify, you're really hitting uh, the bullshit. Yeah, really hitting through the worst people because, you know, you're doing this shit. And I'm here reporting on it. That's right. He compared a Discord server to pedophilia because he got banned. Talk about being a salty little shit. Okay, this should be truly the end of this video. So yeah, I just really wanted to add this in because I kind of forgot about it. But yeah, here you go. Here's proof of gatekeeping and slandering people. Very epic, Marlissify.